Last week, I went eight and three against the number. Chris went seven and four, and that kind of got us, you know, back on the right side of things a little bit. I am sitting at 31, 29, and one. Chris is sitting at 23, 37, and one. Let's start off with Nebraska at Minnesota. Now, these are games that that we have not, or at least I have not hit on the Bet US show. Nebraska, Scott Frost last week just crying after the Minnesota game, uh, or at least looked like it. Like he knew, not the Minnesota, excuse me, the Michigan game. He looked like he was so upset because he knew that was his shot. And Adrian Martinez continues in big time spots. And I think, did we talk about this on the show last week? Like he, yeah. it just, I don't even understand how it's possible, but he has got no clutch gene. At a third and one, and you've got the first down, and you fumble the ball. I mean, it just, it's so irritating. But this is not one of those spots because I don't think they're going to have to worry about a clutch situation here. I think Nebraska is significantly better. Michigan, uh, Michigan, Minnesota, God, I cannot talk tonight. Minnesota is a four point underdog at home. Total is 48. My line on this was actually 10 in favor of Nebraska. I think they are that much better. Minnesota's defense is number 21 uh, in in EPA per rush defense, but Nebraska's defense on the other side is going to shut down Minnesota. They are absolutely going to shut them down. Uh, Minnesota's number 112 in offensive success rate, and, and Nebraska's number 11 in EPA per play on offense. So even if you shut down the run, Adrian Martinez has shown he's able to throw the ball a little bit. I think Nebraska kind of kind of takes out some frustration here. I don't think Minnesota's very good. I'm going to take Nebraska minus the four. Everything in the world is telling me to take Nebraska. If they had a I would 100% take them. But I don't know that Nebraska is a road team. I don't know that Nebraska can go on the road. They're struggling to win games at home. I'm, I'm, I'm going to take the point. I'm going to take the point. I don't know. I think Nebraska has improved a lot there. But I think they'll keep this thing close. I think Nebraska is not good enough to kick the shit out of anybody. So everything's going to be a field goal game, in my opinion. Okay. Okay, that's fair. This this line actually opened at two and a half. It's been bet up to four. Uh, I still like it yep. at four. That's, that's, that's my way. Thanks for listening to the Winning Cures Everything podcast. The website is winningcureseverything.com, and if you want to connect with us, we're on Twitter, at GaryWCE, at ChrisBGiannini, at Winning Cures, or you can email us, Gary at winningcureseverything.com, or Chris at winningcureseverything.com. Subscribe everywhere you need to subscribe, and we'll see you soon.